Wait, you did what? This is Ted. Ted is a normal average guy, except for one thing. Ted loves money. Wait, oh, wait, hold on. Ted, no, sorry. Ted is in love with money. One day, Ted took his love of money to extremes. He thought he was clever, and he'd found a way to skirt the system by printing more money. You do realize what you're doing is causing inflation, right? Inflation? Yeah, you're, you're causing prices to go up. You may be rich, but you're causing prices to go up. A lot of things are costing a lot of money for other people, and soon, people's money is going to be worthless. Even so, the government's consumer price index is showing little or no inflation. Well, try telling that to shoppers in the supermarket checkout line. I can't afford these prices. Okay. How am I supposed to get my daily caffeine? Right? right? How are we going right? to survive with these prices? Right. Money? You're causing I'm them. getting rich. This is not healthy. You need to go see a doctor. You need help. So, I know the name of a good doctor. What's his name? So you're the molten money problem. Come in. They call him the economy doctor. It says here that you are having some problems. A lot of them. It says here that you're copying money. I do have a quick question for you. Have you done anything to cause a lot of people to hate you right now? I did cause inflation. Hey! We'll get in a oh, it's hey! Bad. It's you! The doctor that you told me about is insane. Open your mouth and say, aw. Oh. Um, Tay Save once said, while it's difficult to kill inflation with only one shot, short term measures, such as a price freeze are important as inflation becomes a scourge on the economy. You keep telling me about the ceiling floors. Like as in a price ceiling or a price floor. Floors and ceiling. Um, with price ceilings and price floors, you have shortages, misallocation of resources. He's gonna make me kill myself. Hey, how much longer do I have to do this? I was just a matches for fun.